What's up, everybody? Madcap here, and welcome back to Torchlight 2, Floor 7 of the Broken Mines, deep in the purpley orangeness. Uh, that is the descending mines into the madness of hell, I suppose. A very purple hell, which isn't terrible. Uh, we left off kind of just wandering around the bit of the edge here, so I think I'm just going to go down this way and see if we can't meet these two pieces up. Uh, and take care of whatever's in the middle here. Hopefully it's chocolatey nougaty goodness, but I doubt it. Okay, we're starting off with you guys, huh? Okay, bring you back into the archers. Let's go, archer boys. Yeah. Wait, where'd the other guy go? Did he just die? I don't see his body anywhere. Did he disintegrate? Are we that amazing that we're disintegrating guys now? Probably. Get him, zombies. Oh, those zombies got knocked six ways to Sunday. I don't even know if they did anything. Well, at least they distracted him. It wasn't me getting knocked back. That's all that matters in the end. A little bit of gold. Another one of you guys. Let's do that. Oh, I see somebody shiny in here. And I'm moving slow. All right, I have the high ground. Let's toss my own guys out here. Wait, did they go? Where'd they go? Oh, there they are. God, I, I was summoning them and then I got knocked back and didn't see them anywhere. Okay, got you. Skeletons are taking care of him. Yep, good job, guys. Back up. Heal up. Heal up, back up. Scrolls and potions. That's good, keep my potions going. Although I think I've got uh, quite enough right now, for the most part. And we might get a level in this episode. That'll put us at 56. Uh, which we can kind of figure out points from there. I need to just drop them in something. I don't really know what yet, but just something. Anything. But we'll take a better look at that once we level up again. Fall back. Oh, there's my pet. I can never see my pet. It always seems to just disappear into everybody. I'm like, well, I guess you're down there somewhere doing your stuff. As long as I see things getting summoned, that's really all that matters. Oh, man. We've reached a dead end. Hmm. Well, uh, I, I, I don't feel like this would probably loop back around, but we're so over, ouch. There we go, okay. We're so over committed on this area now, we might as well finish it off. If I'm gonna have to walk all the way back there, was that massive crits achievement unlocked? Uh, for, uh, we're gonna spend so much time getting back there anyways that I might as well just keep going here and see what I can find. Mm, I should probably heal. Probably should have done that by the chest, but that's all right. Okay. Well, there's the portal or the stairs or whatever you want to call it. It actually looks like at least the Nether Lord. Huh. All right, well, let's go find this last dinky little piece, probably, that will mean nothing. Well, there's some gold, along with a bunch of fire. I'm assuming we killed somebody there. Oh, it's you. Oof, I did not recognize that guy quick enough. Oh, that poor chest. I'm just going to let all of those things deal with you. There was so much stuff, even a bat was in there joining the party. And I don't see anything else here, I don't think. Doesn't look like there's anything on the map here. No secret entrances, exits, levers, or what have you. Okay, back to the Netherlord stairs. I don't have anything I need to do as far as I'm aware. I don't really know 
what I could do to prepare. I mean, I guess I could spend points, um, since I'm apparently not going to level up before fighting the Netherlord boss. So, our next level up would be 56. Not enough for you. Not enough for that. Um, I mean, technically I've got all these to do. Technically, I've also got this, but I don't I don't really have anything that does that kind of damage. I've got the bow, which does what? Two types of damage? Ice and poison. And that's it. So I feel like that would be more or less a waste. Hmm. Giving him more damage and more lifetime. And that's always good, right? I bump you up. And I guess I might as well take him up. Ooh, I can actually get him up too. Sure, I'll take that. 30%, that's an extra 10% damage, I think is what it was originally at, right? Do both of those, that's good, that's good. And that leaves me one point left over with nothing really to spend it in, per se. I mean, I could unlock this, I guess, but doesn't really seem that useful, right? I could just keep raising my bats and make all of these work together. But I'll keep that one point. Just in case. I'm glad I checked the Shadow Brute guy. Getting him two levels is definitely, definitely handy. Okay. What have we got here? Okay. He's trying to scare me. Well, it ain't gonna work. And there's nothing else here, so we'll just step through the portal. Ooh, this place is fancy. There's floating rocks, although I don't know where those are going. Wasn't I just above this area? I, I don't remember seeing any rocks floating by me. Man, this those rocks that are on chains reminds me of... Uh, what's the full title? The Edge? Edge Chronicles, I think? Edge something Chronicles? It, it's a book series I was reading. And they have floating rocks in that. Kind of strange parallel. What all do we have here? I'm kind of skirting the edge just to see what's going on. Oh, that's... Okay, well... I'm assuming this isn't going to do anything, but I'll summon it just in case. Oh dear. You look like not the friendly sort. Okay, can I do this? Usually you can't for bosses, but it looks like it did something. Skeletal archers, let's go. Get behind our skeletal archers. Do some damage. Let's get that Mr. Man going. The, oh my god. Okay, let's stay out of that. Let's do that again. That way I can run around and do stuff while waiting. I did not mean to throw that that close. Okay, let's help out with the small fry around the edges. Summon out our skeletons again. And they all went into the fire. I think they're all dead, actually. Oh no, there's a couple left. Ugh, get our mana back. Okay, what do we got? Phase two is... He's more tangible of a being. My guy looks so small in comparison. Ow, that is very much pain. Where'd my guy go? Oh, he died, didn't he? Oh, boy. Okay, let's throw this out. Ouch. There's some skull archers back here. I'm gonna kind of keep him in the range of that. This guy is gigantic. Ugh. Yeah, I gotta run from that. Gotta go! Mm, I think I'll take my healings elsewhere, kind sir. How about right here? And let's throw these down. No, what? Oh, they always go the way you're facing, don't they? Okay, I'm running away. And I'm going back. But I don't want to get stuck. Why are these guys not attacking? Are they stunned? Ah, crap. 
Man. Oh. Let's go ahead and use a potion for that. I'm gonna get back. I wish I could zoom the map out more so I could see this guy. He takes up the whole screen. Okay. Are you, wait, is he actually dead dead? There's not a phase three? Achievement unlocked, the king is dead. I guess, I guess so. That's weird. Didn't the alchemist have like eight phases? Hmm. I don't see anything to grab here. Wow, man, that guy looks cool. Can I summon him instead of my guy? That would be awesome. What are you? Are you going to attack me? I'm going to shoot you. The Clockwork Core has the clockwork the world from the Netherim for longer than even the Guardians can remember. As the Core wound down, the Netherim slipped through. They brought destruction to the races of the world. They subjugated the powerful and concealed themselves well, awaiting the time when they could hold one Ew. true hero in their thrall. One capable of destroying the clockwork core and throwing wide the gate between worlds. Yet they did not foresee that another hero would arise to stand against them and seal the Netherim in their ethereal prison once more. That's weird. That's not actually... That wasn't actually layered properly. That was bizarre. It's supposed to be inside of the rings. So you can see the rings traveling behind it. But in that animation, they were all traveling in front of it. Strange oversight, but I guess it's not really... It doesn't affect anything. Uh, I don't... So I still don't see... I want to make sure there's no, like, super treasure chest that spawn in anywhere. But I don't see any. And I can't do anything with that. Can I just destroy it instead and become all-powerful? No? Ugh. Back to the surface we go. The mine hedge. And we are over here. Okay. Do I need to talk to you? Yeah, I do. Do you have anything new? You do. Level 4. I already got it. Treasure Hunter level 4 would be kind of nice to have, I guess. But I don't have any spots to put it in. So that's basically useless. Wait, is this a Sentinel? Oh no, Iron Lord. Sentinel's the right. Okay, I forgot. It's, it's been a little while since I've recorded, so I forgot what I was looking for. Which is nothing now. Those who are dead, they can barely Let Yes, well, I'll go charge them all individually. I'll be sending a mass mailer of bills out. Uh, tiny amounts of gold. Mmm, tiny amounts of experience and a decent amount of fame, I guess. Gray Sky Omen. Can't use that. Labyrintho? Oh, this gives bow range. Critical damage, critical chance, cast speed is up a little bit, charge rate. Eh, it seems okay, I guess. Liberation armor. This seems like a caster thing to do. Here's a bow, the beast bane. Very fast, 0.56, ice and poison. Wait, that's exactly what I have! What are the odds of that? That's crazy! Okay, so it's exactly the same as what I've got. 8, 28, 20 bonus, 7, minus, yeah! Exactly what I've got, wow. The dog bark? What is it, boy? Is it danger? Wait, how come this bow has green flavor text on it, but mine doesn't? Also, it's it's kind of funny seeing this on the screen at once. 
because it says unique bow when we're clearly looking at two identical bows. A little bit amusing. Uh, not even anywhere close to getting that. I guess I'll just take my bow again. I don't know. I don't really need any of that. Fame increase. That means we get an extra skill point. Which is always good. Um, let us take a look at this. A mysterious great sword. The Dragon's Bane. Sounds cool. Feel my blade, dragon, and despair. Fire and poison. Mysterious cannon. Old iron gob. This will shut him up. <laughs> Old iron gob? That's a weird name for a cannon. Uh, okay, let's put these over here. Which, by over here, I mean in this one, obviously. And, wait, what? What just happened? I want this over here. I don't know why that tossed it on the ground. Okay, let's put this over here. Since we're obviously going to want to use that. And we'll leave those alone for now. Okay, what's up next on the list here? We got a green guy over here. What are the other quests you've got for me? Who are you? I don't remember you being here before. You seem weary. Perhaps you are in need of a fresh perspective. If you so desire, I can allow you to retrace your steps with all of the knowledge you currently possess. Simply ask, and I can show you the way. Is that... Oh, wait a minute. The legendary Mapworks is operational once more. From the Mapworks, you can navigate to all sorts of wondrous places. Many fine adventures surely await you within. Hmm. I don't know what either of these are. I... Guessing th is that the end of the game? I, I don't actually know. What the heck is the map works? I probably don't want to accept her quest because that sounds like it's starting over with everything you've got, but what, at a more difficult difficulty of a difficultness? I, I guess I can go see what this is. The map works. What is this? Gem saver, gem smasher. Map selector. Maps to exotic dungeons. Which I don't have any of. Whoa. Okay. 96 to 100? Holy cow. It looks like the lowest is 48. So I can do that. 924. That's not that much. Should I just buy one? Do I have to use it? Uh, Do this? Wait, do I have to keep it in here forever? That seems weird. I don't trust that. I don't think that's correct. There's a couple bows in here. But I'm poor. Multi-purpose merchant. A rare pistol. What, do you have anything? High Ridge? I mean, I don't know why I bother looking at those. It's not like I've ever completed a set yet. Every time I want a set and I start collecting, it just goes away. I guess High Ridge is the new one, then? Physical armor, melee, 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 which means no way. Oh, you sell potions. So you just do everything. You're transmuter. You're just a regular enchanter guy. Okay. Hmm. Well, no, not you. I would like to see what these are. I'm curious how long these are, what the rewards are, what you do. Achievement unlocked. X marks the spot. So what? Uh, what do we do in here? What is this? Dungeon. Oh. 10% increase in magic finding luck. And then what? I can just do these forever? I'm assuming. Ooh, those guys are strong. I'm gonna back away from that. Phew! Okay. So we got bone guys. Gargoyles. Try to hit most of those guys while they were kind of together. 
Ow! Ow, rude. Yes, okay. 146 gold, that's not bad. Oh, that's clever. They should have locked me in there, though. That would have been even more hilarious. Can I get you all here together? Where'd they go? You can't just off the map. Ah, uh, okay, uh... Lever. Oof. Don't really know how much damage that did, and I don't want to find out. That was a trap. Of course it was a trap. Why wouldn't it be? A mysterious pistol? Dang! That's one, two, three, four... Orange weapons? Okay. Yes, I know I'm wounded. I was trying to move, and I couldn't move. Hence why I used every last healing thing I had. Gold? Oh wait, did that go somewhere? No, it did not, because that was the... the spinning treasure death room. This will take us down there. Yeah, yeah, yeah! 23 gold? Thanks, chest. You did good. Yeah, bag of bones. You can't stop me. I wonder if there's secrets in these. I would imagine not, but you never know. Are these also randomly generated? Like, would I come into the same area with the same properties that it told me when I bought it, but the map is, like, regenerated to look different? Like, a different way to go? That is the question. Oh, that was perfect. Everybody gather around that rock. Old Papa Mad Cat. He's got a gift for you. Once again, I see these books, and I keep thinking back to Grim Dawn where I can read them. Can't read those. Oh, this is not healthy for me. Just use the green. Just use the green. There's too much going on there. Whew. Uh, Legion, I'll take that. Anything up here? It doesn't look like it. Yes! Stairs of Carnage! I'm glad I looked up there. Oh no, there's a way to go down there. Mm, never mind. Yes! Knocked them back into the poison. That guy knocked me down the stairs. There's all kinds of knocking going around here. And these gargoyles hit you back so much. Stupid gargoyles. I'll take that two gold, thank you. I'm sure, that was totally worth the time of going back to. Yes! This is. This is going a lot further than I thought it would. Oof! Whew. That level up. I would say it came just in time, but I had already spammed all of my health spells and potions and skills and whatever. So it came a little bit too late. If I had waited just a split second more, I could have gotten all my health back for free. Guess it doesn't really matter all that much. Of course it appears up there. Wow, we got another orange thing. I like this dungeon. This is good. Oh, so you can be not blue chests. Interesting. Let's see what that thing we got was. Some kind of skull. Well, what's this? A mysterious pistol. It's got four barrels. That seems pretty darn fancy. Oh, it's part of a set. Wait, 100% chance to execute? That's... Interesting. Doesn't that mean it executes on every shot? 
I guess you'd have to find all three pieces, though, which would probably make that extremely unlikely to get, ever. Uh, 40 strength attribute or minus 89 to all armor per hit. Still don't know what that means, but it sounds really neat. And while I'm here, let's go ahead and chuck this stuff into the dog. Chuck it to the dog. There we go. And let's move these up here. I don't need blue claws. Don't need that blue armor. Don't need that blue sword. There we go. All right. Thank you, dog. Oh, that just, like, reflected backwards into the guy. I wasn't even looking at him. There we go. Get that knock back. There's a lot going on up there. I think there's a special guy as well. I saw him somewhere. There he is. Okay, yeah, let's get rid of these guys first. Ouch. The heck? I'm gonna go ahead and put you out of your misery. There you go. Alright, what are you? Roar Ada. Ada. There's an H there. Level 55, so he's right on level with me. I'm gonna stay away from that spinning purple thing, though. So far, so good. Shatter block. Did we get him? We got him! I love having my dog be like this autonomous unit. Ooh, that's a lot of gold. This autonomous unit that I can just leave alone and it'll just spawn tons of stuff to stop things. Well, there you go. Those guys are finished off. I'm not going to go there just yet, though. I would like to see where this other path leads. I don't know if these meet up at all. Okay, pass it that guy. I'm just gonna keep running around in the back. Yeah, I wanna go up here. Seems like there's a lot of stuff going on down in this area, so I'm hoping this one is kind of just a dead end. With a wee bit of luck. Yeah, 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 you're gonna jump and scare everybody. Okay, do this. Okay. There we go. Push him back. Unless of these. Stay back. I saw that coming, at least. Oof. Okay, it wasn't going for me that time, so that's fine. Well, this is going all over the place, too. Yeah, I'm gonna get you before you jump. It's so nice having this acid rain now for crowd control. I see a large group of guys. Oh, wow, this was actually the correct way to go. Wow, how ironic is that? Okay, well, sometimes you guess incorrectly. All right, let's check this area first. We got a couple ways to go here. Okay, I think most of that acid missed. Ah, oh, lucky. Reminds me of a Pokemon using fly. It's like you've already got your attack off, but they fly, and so your attack just misses. It's annoying. Back up. Can I hit both of them? No. They're both still alive. Oh, man. Okay. There's definitely a lot of ways to go here. No, I would like to move. Thank you. Take that guy out. Oh, he's already dead. I was about ready to shoot another arrow. God, that was a weird effect. I thought the whole wall was moving in to crush me. When that wolf guy was moving. I don't know why. Yeah, dodge that. Let's go ahead and get rid of him. Get rid of these normal guys. Back up. I'm moving so slow. Urgh. Okay, there we go. Man. I don't know why he kept slowing me, or what what attack that was, but it was 
keeping me slowed for quite a while. Okay, so this is gonna go back up here. A whole lot of gold down there. I would like that, please. Which means what? Quick, so this loops back around there. That covers that. This is the door it looks like I need to go through. And the lever's up there. Which means I have to go back this way. Go up here and then go across this little ramp. Got it! Should've gone this way first. Okay. Doors open. I like how my skeleton just jumped down. He's like, I got this. And that looks like a fair bit of gold, at least. Maybe a few hundred? Let's see. 26. Uh, I guess we could see roughly. So we're at 44,000. See how much this actually is. Doesn't look like a whole lot. Forty-six thousand. That was a couple thousand. That's actually better than I thought it would be. It's not bad at all. Now let's see what's over here, behind this door. Maybe there was some good gold down there as well. Okay, well that opened the door. We already got that. Yeah, there's a bunch of gold down there. Oh, damn it! I tried to move away from that. It did not work. I got a true blade. Oh, well, the gold's over here. Oh, I need to heal. Why are there so many levers down there? That's weird. There's nothing down there. It's just levers and ten gold. Is this a trap? Oh, that you're alive. I couldn't see where the hell was, what was alive. Secret room. Achievement unlock. It in service of secrets. What does this get me? Gold. Yeah, I'm gonna take you out. There you go. There you go. I swear I saw more levers down here. I guess I was mistaken. I thought there was like three of them. Okay, well, what does this lever do? Ah, a couple secret chests and some gold. Sweet. Another go uh, gold item. I guess it's kind of gold. A lucky coin. Okay. What does this coin do? That's not a coin. This is a coin. 1% increase in the amount of gold found. That's just it's not useful at all. What is this? Another 7 mana. That's pretty darn good. I'll take that. If I had something with a couple slots, I can combine those. Not that I really need more mana than the 10 I'm already getting, so... I guess it's not all that useful. Down we go into the depths of the keep. Oh, I need to spend my points. Thank you, loading screen, for uh, letting me know. Thank you so very much. And then I think... Oh, of course, I was waiting for that. Oh, I thought I was out of the range of that stupid thing. Okay. Uh, let's go ahead and spend our points here. Strength, dexterity, and vitality. As per the usual. And I don't think I have any skills I can really do yet. I need to save a couple points for these. That's still two levels away, though. Not all that useful. I mean... I feel like I should up this. I have it. Probably does nothing now. 53% of weapon DPS is poison damage, which isn't terrible. 16% chance on kill to explode. 
I have three points, that's right. I almost feel like I should up this three more levels. Because I've got it, I might as well put something into it so it's used, right? That's also 58, though. That's 58 as well. Oh my god, these all unlock 58. One, two, three, four. All right, maybe I'll be saving these points after all. Um, I think... I... Oh god. I'm slow. Okay, you know what? I just wanted to peek out here for a second. That's all I wanted. Okay, are you guys gonna explode? Oh no, you're the potion throwers, that's right. It's not a trap. Another orange weapon. Hmm. I don't know why I'm getting so many of those all of a sudden. I mean, 10% isn't actually that much, is it? Or just, do I just have a lucky seed, is that all? I don't know what it is. Where's this going? I see, I, here's the problem, I don't know how far these go. And this looks like it keeps going, so... I'm gonna walk back here. Oh, I should probably regain my health, just in case. Here we go, okay. Walk back here, and we'll stop the episode off here. I hope it's the ending of this isn't right around the corner, but it very well could be, um, for all I know, since I don't know anything about these yet. But at least we made it into here. I don't know. I think we beat Torchlight. I mean, no credits rolled, so I'm not entirely sure. But according to that lady, it sounds like she resets your progress. So maybe I'll go look before I do anything with that, just to make sure I'm not going to screw myself over, because if I did beat all of Torchlight, that means we're done with the game. So that's basically it. I'll probably play a couple of these, maybe two or three of these little map worlds to go through, um, and go through that lady, see what she has to offer me, maybe? I don't know. And then if it just resets me back to the beginning, then we're done with the game. And that's basically it. So we'll play a couple of these these maps, see what we can get out of it, have a little bit of fun, and I'm going to do some research just to see where the hell I'm at in Torchlight 2, uh, and if it's the ending or not. But it kind of seems like it is, so we'll see. We'll come back, we'll finish the Wyvern Keep, unless it goes for like 100 floors, then I don't know. I guess we'll just keep going until it ends, and try out a couple more maps. And that's the roadmap for now with Torchlight 2. But that's going to do for this episode. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you on the next one. Until then, stay metal.